Okay, I'm so interested as to what is going on. And, um, yeah, you can see why. It is finally time for me to face my fears and play some of these Japanese themed horror games, okay? This is one of them. We're gonna start with this. And this is the other one we're gonna play, so I don't know, man. Let's just get this over with and not dwell on it too much because maybe I'm just overhyping it and they're not that scary, so let's get into it. Oh, and by the way, before we start the game, this warning did come up on the screen, so if you have photosensitive epilepsy, you may want to skip out on the video. I'm gonna do my best to edit out the parts that get pretty bad, but you should definitely skip it and yeah, I just wanted to put this warning in. All right, I've been on this title screen long enough. Let's play. Um, I don't know exactly. Okay, there you go. I was postponing because I was afraid, but I was also confused on how to actually start it. So we're in the game now. And like I said, maybe we're just overhyping it. It's not that bad, but I got to say, I love the style. Retro games are my thing. So I've kind of got a love-hate relationship going on right now. Mostly hate. Because it's a horror game, of course. Seems to be a floating piece of earth. And, I mean, the water sounds are definitely calming me down. I don't know what to do here. I just went in a menu and we're reading a letter, so... I don't know what it's all about, but... As you can see, it's talking about someone traveling to the end of a narrow stone path. Oh wait, this is telling me what to do. Okay, I see. I mean, we're at the end of the stone path. And I'm guessing we're supposed to keep looking this way. But I don't want to, man. Maybe you're supposed to read the letter while looking down this pathway. Oh my god. I was right. Um, That looks like a face. I don't know exactly what I'm looking at right now. What? It it's gone. Oh. Consider this tree in our land to be one in the same. Okay, just talking to me. Doesn't seem to be bad. Uh, si um, uh, I'm not even going to try to pronounce that, but you see it on the screen, okay? A sin douche That's my best guess. This plant is our fate, and it's water or fuel. Oh, yeah, it's talking about the plant behind me, the floating piece of grass. I will provide you with the tools to make altercations, okay? Do whatever you must, but don't feed it with what you bleed. Can you please speak? Like, in a normal way, so I know what you're talking about. Um, gave me something. Oh, I think these are for the water, right? Okay, I see. You know, that guy, he's kind of a dick, okay? Sure, I'm probably a dumbass and I missed something, but he could have spoke to me in, like, a normal manner, you know? Like, we could have a normal conversation. I don't know why he has to speak in these weird... Okay, here we go. Never mind. We're in this forest clearing, it seems. I see something down there. Do you see that? It's pixelated, so it's hard to see. But we have a flask of water. I don't know how much that's going to help us. What is that? Oh, it's like a cat person. Okay. We do have a friend out here, it seems. There's constant pain in my empty stomach. Uh, hoping he doesn't eat me. Seems he's hungry. As much as I kind of like our new friend, I think I'm going to leave him. Maybe water? Does he want water? No, he's, he's just talking to me. Okay. Never mind. I'll leave him alone. So we do have some options here. That's the way we came. I don't know why it's floating, but you know what? It's best we don't even question it. That is very unsafe, okay? This bridge has no railings, and there's a giant gaping pit down there. They do not care about safety here, it seems. Okay, we're gonna go this way. Okay, this was in the preview of the game. This part. But, honestly, I feel kind of peaceful here. What does this say? Oh, there's a note here. If you were reading this, I am dead. Okay. This tool once aided my research, and I hope it will do the same. Be warned, I fear this blade has become- Nice, we got a blade, dude. Awesome. It may only have a few strikes in it. Dude, I don't care. As long as we have some sort of weapon. Did I see something? Maybe it was just the water moving? Oh, there's some fishies. Hey, guys. Okay, so we're heading up now. I'm a little worried about what we're gonna find up here, but there's no turning back. Oh, okay. Honestly, this game is way more peaceful than I expected. I was overhyping it, it seems. And I'm fine with that. I'm actually happy I was overhyping it. 
So, I mean, we've got some peaceful music in the background. Gotta find my way up here. I think I have to go around here. Yeah, our character can't jump, sadly, so. Looks like a new home, honestly. I would love to live here. Imagine you had a house like this, that would be awesome. Uh. Yeah, I don't know why I'm assuming he's dead. He could just be sleeping, okay? That could be a nice picture of just a fisherman sleeping after a catch, as you can see there. Caught a fish. Some sort of potions. Can we sleep? Oh, we can. Why did I... Uh. Why did I sleep? We should have savored the day. Um... I can't tell if the game's actually glitching out or this is supposed to happen. I'm guessing it's supposed to happen. What the hell's that? I think I prejudged him. I got scared, man. I think he's a nice guy. I was not expecting anything there, but... Yeah, he doesn't look too bad. We should stop assuming these guys are... He's pointing... To this direction. Have you seen a painting around here? I saw it a long time ago, and it won't leave my mind. I've traveled a long time to see it, and it's gone. Such is death, I guess. Oh, is he talking about the fishing painting? Is it even there? Yeah, it's gone. I think that's what he's talking about. Okay, I guess we're gonna go this way. I honestly feel like I'm tripping out, though. So, I'm starting to wonder, maybe... I took some acid before this video on accident. I don't know how I did that, but I'm guessing it's just the game. I just realized, let's sleep this bad trip off, okay? Surely it's gonna... Okay. That was weird, man. Is he there? No, he's not. Seems to be a fishing boat. Please tell me we can go fishing. Wait, is the picture still there? Okay, it is. It's there. Can we go fishing, maybe? Can I? Oh, I can. All right, I'm postponing it enough. We have to go back to sleep. I'm wondering if that did anything. I mean, the boat's on the other side now. Oh, maybe we should go over here. There seems to be some sort of monument this way. I'm wondering if we could have went here in the normal version of the world. That's definitely something to check. Oh, that's a noose. I'm not liking this. What is this? A gravestone for a fisherman sits here. It reads, please cut my shackle of rope. Okay, I'll do that for you. Is it working? Oh, there we go. Oh, damn it. My blade's gone. Um, it's flesh could kill an immortal, but it can't harm plants. Oh, is it? Is he talking about the fish we saw? Those seem like peaceful fish, so it must be a different one. You need to feed this fruit to anything with a beating heart. Take the victim's blood. Uh, I don't know about this. I know the plant. Please kill it. Okay, I see. So we have a choice here. Save us all from eternity. We need non-existence. Um, so we have a choice. We can either save the plant or kill it, it seems. And I don't know, man. Something about that talking hand. I don't really trust it, but... I don't know. I feel like we might need to kill it. So... We have time to decide, though. Okay, let me just check over here if anything's different. Seems like the noose is gone. I don't know if it was there before. It probably wasn't. Oh, wait. I got the fishing pole. Can we go? Yes, dude. Please tell me you can go fishing. This is amazing. Do you think we can cook it, too? Um, okay. Okay, we got the fish. No! No! Why'd I do that? I just remembered, there's a place we haven't been yet, so let's go there. I'm pretty sure down here, yeah, there's another way. Oh god, I feel less peaceful over here. I don't know how it switched to nighttime. Maybe it was just a long travel, but... Oh! Hold on a second. I know what to do. Remember that cat was saying he was hungry? We're gonna get a fish and we're gonna bring it back to him. Alright, let's see if he likes fish. I mean, it is a cat, so... Pretty sure he's gonna like it. Here you go, buddy. Found you some food. Wonder if you can give me anything. Oh yeah. Constance painting my empty There you go. Seems you liked it. Now I should return the favor. Thank you. What are you gonna give me? 
Here, take some of this black stuff. Um, okay. I know we produced plenty of it back home. Are you going to tell me what it is, though? Although I can hardly remember my home. All I can seem to recall is fire. It's probably not good. You might want to get that checked out, man. Um, oh, wait. You know what? We could probably fill one of these vials with it. Let's see here. Yeah. What is this? Oil. We could go back and kill that plant. I'm pretty sure that's the only thing we can do right now, so... We're gonna kill him with whatever this is, but I'm not gonna equip it yet, just in case anything, you know, tries to attack me. Maybe we throw it in the water? Oh god. This is embarrassing. I'm pretty sure it told me what to do and I just fucked everything up. You know what? Let's just drop some oil in here, okay? Oh. Is the game mad at me? I'm sorry, game. Ending one, parasites. Okay, so, um, interesting. Okay, so this is the next one we're gonna play. I hope it's a lot like this one, where it's not too bad. All right, I mean, I'm starting to look stupid now. I don't think we should have been afraid. I mean, look at the title screen, okay? It says day one, cat zero on the side. I don't know what that's all about. So let's just get into it, figure this out as we go. And yeah, I mean, very welcoming title screen, I gotta say, okay? I do like cats. I'm a big cat guy. Oh, there we go. Here's a cat. I mean, I'm starting to get a little uncomfortable seeing as the screen's getting a little red, so... Red is obviously a bad color, but that was just a video of a cat, it seems. Um... What? Oh, wait, how do we... Okay, so you turn with the arrow keys. This is... Hold on. I'm gonna have to get used to this a little bit. Oh my god, you have to move... Oh. I know the controls, they're a little weird, but I think I can adapt. There's a giant cat statue up ahead. Uh, I don't know why these windmills are... Okay, I think they're trees, not windmills, but you get the point. They are flying, which is kind of weird, but I do. I, it seems I have a lot more time in this one, so that's good. Are these houses enterable? No. Okay. Um, okay, that's a little weird. The trees are upside down now, as you can see. I don't know why I always talk to you like you're blind. You can clearly see the trees are upside down. Is that cat moving? No, that's one of these things. What are... Okay, they're getting kind of close. Okay, we can run. That's good to know. Maybe we have to pray to the cat statue. Possibly. Oh, no. All right, so I think this is day five we're on. We're not. Oh, we're in a city now. Okay, so we're just taking a stroll through the city, it seems. Let's go down this way. We're just gonna kind of look off into the ocean dramatically, I guess. I'm fine with that. I'm hearing something. Oh my god, I do not like how slow it is to turn around. Are you hearing that too? Okay. I guess that's it. I hope we're not supposed to do something and I'm just too slow to figure it out each time. Oh, that's interesting. What? No! No! Those are catfish. Literal catfish. What's that over there? That's a giant cat. Please don't tell me that's what I think it is. Okay, that's an actual... Okay. I thought that was like a cat cow for a second, but that's a cat. Oh, hey. Hey, buddy. What? Is he... Is this some sort of cat god? There are purple planets over there. I don't know what I did to that cat, but he just completely jetpacked out of the area. Is that a catfish on land? Oh my god. Okay. It's about time we do not put anything past this game. I'm always wondering, like, what is that? And I'm like, oh, it's a cat. It, it, no matter what, anything's gonna be a cat in this game. I'm surprised these aren't cat trees. But... What is this? Okay, it's a cat. Why am I asking... I just said I wasn't gonna ask questions. I have a feeling we should avoid him. Oh, he's just dancing. Okay. We're, we're fine. We're not. Maybe I shouldn't have gone that way, but... It's too late now. Oh, hey, man. Is this some sort of shop? Maybe we could buy something? Or he's just, he's just playing. That little square thing. Where are we? We're in some sort of cat city, I'm guessing. This is a library. And people are just checking out some books, I guess. Guess I'll do the same. These shelves are empty, so these books are selling, man. They're definitely selling. Only that shelf, though, so I don't know if that was... I don't know. 
it really doesn't matter. I don't even know why I'm talking about it. Okay, so here we go. We're on the second floor of the library. Maybe some homeless cats. Oh. Sorry, I didn't mean to... Oh, I scared them away. Okay. Wow, these cats, man. That's definitely some cat graffiti going on. There are some scoundrels living in a uh, cat city, it seems. What was that noise? Maybe it's a horn of some sort? Maybe there's a boat docking? Oh yeah, there is. An actual boat, okay. Maybe that's where we're going. Oh, there's some cats down there. Maybe they're the graffiti cats and we can bust them. Okay, there's definitely a cat there. I'm not seeing things at this point. We did see a cat there. Hey, can I join you guys? There it is again. I think it's a cat ghost. Yeah, it's definitely a cat ghost. Oh, wait. There we go. I'm on day six, cats one. That's new. I'm wondering if these may be cat plants or something like that. I'm honestly surprised they don't have cat ears. Seeing as this game is um centered around cats. I'm pretty sure it's safe to say that. Okay, I don't think anybody would argue with that. That plant seems to be shitting out rainbows, which is new. I don't think I've ever seen a game do that, but let's try and explore. Just in case the game, you know, takes me out again, I want to explore. What the hell is that? That is a cat, fish, bat sort of hybrid creature. Is that a frog? I don't even think that's a cat. No, it's a cat turtle. Okay. How dare I assume it's a frog and not a cat. These are cat pictures. It's a very cute cat. Gotta say. Oh my god. This is a very interesting game, you could say. Oh no, we're gone. I saw something. Do you see that? I don't know what that was. Maybe it's just a cat. But we're on day eight. This game has definitely got my attention right now. Okay, I'm so interested as to what is going on. And, um, yeah, you can see why. Okay, you can definitely see why. Oh god, um, they look very happy. Okay, I'm just gonna let them do their thing. The feeling I'm getting when I play this game is that I'm too stupid, okay, to understand anything. You know, the, the person who made this game obviously has an extremely high IQ that is unprecedented, honestly. Oh god, this place again. That cat ghost is on a different chair. Oh, there's a lot of cat ghosts. Let's see if we can catch the boat this time. Oh yeah, it doesn't even dock here. What? Um. That is not something I want to see. Okay, let's put it that way. Seems to be some sort of cat spider in the water. I don't know. I, that's definitely my least favorite cat so far. I'm trying to understand. I really am, but like I said, I'm not on the level of whoever made this game. Clearly. Okay, I don't like this now. Seems to be some... Um... Oh god, I hate this now. I'm starting to not like this game anymore. Seems to be some sort of cat poltergeist. Oh, what the... Oh, that's just a... F it's a fucking flower, dude. Ooh, it's a fisherman. Let's talk to him. Is that a dead... Oh. Because we did see a fisherman in the last one. The last game, so I was wondering if they were connected if, in some way, but it doesn't seem to be the case. Oh, there we go. We did something. Let's see if that giant spider cat... Oh, nope. Never mind. We've been kicked out. Day 11, cats won. Okay. <laughs> Not gonna lie. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I kind of got scared there. A little scared, but it wasn't too bad. It was just a cat. Yeah, here we are. And I don't think I've gone this way. Wait. Uh. No, it's a cat. He's, um. Searching the. Oh! Okay. Maybe if I, you know, took some acid beforehand, we would know what to do, but I, I truly don't. I'm gonna approach a skeleton. Or not skeleton. Statue. I don't know why I said skeleton, but. You know what I think happened 
the game realized how stupid I was, and it's now not even letting me play. And I don't blame it. Those were two more haunted PS1 games, and I'm very happy I overhyped them, honestly. You know, they weren't too bad. And I mean, the second one, the cat one, was just enjoyable, okay? Sure, I didn't know what I was doing 100% of the time. And you know what? In the next episode, we're gonna play something that's probably worse, okay? I'm trying to look here to see a specific game I wanna point out. Um, I don't know what happened to the preview of that one. Oh, I forgot, exit, exit's the game. Okay, a very bad outro to the video, but the point still remains. We're gonna play two more Haunted PS1 games in the next one. See ya.